Look out. All right, two betrayals. We start off by getting assaulted by sentinels. Uh, this is going to be particularly a difficult level. Uh, I know I feel like I've said that for like a good majority of them, but two betrayals is quite the beast of its own. It's taken pretty much all of the assault we on the control room level. Halo. We have to stop him. We have to destroy Halo. According to my analysis of the available data, I believe the best course of action is somewhat risky. An explosion of sufficient size will help destabilize the ring and will cut through a number of primary systems. We need to trigger a detonation on a large scale, however. A starship's fusion reactor is going critical with the job. I'm going to search what's left of the Covenant battle net and see if I can locate the Pillar of Autumn's crash site. If the ship's fusion reactors are still relatively intact, we can use them to destroy Halo. Yeah, so anyways, with what I was saying, two betrayals is basically assault on the control room, like all of it, essentially. And there is quite a bit that's thrown at you. This is, honestly, it feels like a penultimate level to like an FPS game, but it's actually not surprisingly. And without a doubt in my mind, I wouldn't be surprised if people were really caught up on this level. There's just so much that's thrown at you, it's kind of insane in its own right. You kind of have to like know the level in and out in terms of what's coming your way. Because if you don't, you're basically in, you're basically in big trouble. Hey. Let me win. The crash site yet, but we need to buy some time in case the monitor or his sentinels find a way to activate Halo's final weapon without the index. The machinery in these canyons are Halo's primary firing mechanisms. They consist of three phase pulse generators that amplify Halo's signal and allow it to fire deep into space. The power levels are enormous. I can't even begin to calculate the pulse's range. So, if we damage or destroy these generators, the monitor will need to repair them before Halo can be used. That should buy us some time. I'm marking the location of the nearest pulse generator with a nav point. We need to move in and neutralize the device. So I don't really have too many tips and tricks. Sounded really weird. Tips and tricks I can really offer, except really just kind of like play it very safe for a majority of the level. Like, <laughs> and that's not a joke. You can get absolutely destroyed very easily without a clear idea as to what type of enemies you're going up against and needless to say not only are we dealing with some high tier elites like we're gonna be seeing a gold one uh when we get down uh this whole good old structure but there's also a wraith down there and don't worry it does get piloted and it is very scary i think what i'm gonna try to do is rush for the banshee hope that i can get to it Keyword being hope, because again, you never know with this kind of level. It can get pretty dicey pretty quick. And I can miss all my sniper shots just like right just like that. I'd say that's pretty good. Seems like this jackal's got a mind of his own. Oh, I got one more shot left. I wish that uh Wish that worked a little better. There we go. I stunned him with the shotgun, and then we followed it up with a grenade. All right, let's uh, let's see how well I fare here. Okay. Normally, I like to slide down; just makes it a little easier. Although this part coming up is gonna be brutal. I think I'm gonna try to save that health cut. Maybe I can lure him up here. Maybe. I'm not really sure. Oh yeah, we, we need to... Yeah, now the rate's firing at us. Thankfully, I don't think it's going to be able to reach us all that well. I hope. Oh, come on, real? Wait, did that get him? Oh my god, that got him. 
that's impressive in its own right. I do want to try to get that Wraith, though. The Wraith is a huge concern. I almost just completely bamboozled me. I'm glad it didn't. I'll try to snipe it with the rocket launcher. Maybe I can do that. I just gotta be careful of those shots, because they do not mess around. The Wraith shots are heavily dangerous, to say the very least. Oh no, I'm in trouble. Ooh, please die. So thankfully, the Wraith is down, but we still have quite a number of elites to deal with. And my only thinking process is, eh, I'll just chuck a few grenades at him. See if I can get him to move around. Yeah, that's one down. It looks like the others from the other side are starting to move up onto this side. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Gotta be careful. Okay. Almost there. Okay, that's one. That's actually a pretty high tier elite down, so I can appreciate that. I believe that's another elite down. I think we got the area cleared out. Yeah, I'm not. No, I don't care. <laughs> I don't. I don't care if that's uh, me going a bit overkill. Uh, it's 100% worth it. Given just what you're dealing with in this level. And now we just gotta fly up to there. And that's not gonna be too tricky. Let's get moving. The nav point marks our target. Oof. Yeah, honestly the intro gives me a lot of trouble. Uh at least for me out of two out of all of two betrayals like that. That little intro segment is without a doubt the biggest kicker to the face just because like i said you know a lot of elites got a tank to deal with like a wraith and it's it's pretty overwhelming when you're playing on legendary it's it's definitely a tricky one you just gotta play a little smart that's all objective accomplished the pulse generator has overloaded scanning the generator central core is offline well done Okay, I was thinking I could get out of here in one piece, but that does not seem to be the case. Well, the plasma pistol makes short work of the sentinels. Even the plasma rifle does a good job, too. You can't... It doesn't hurt to carry a plasma weapon with you at all times. I'm gonna use this one because it's fresh banshee. Banshee, which I know I speak. Mark the target with the nav point when we get closer. Thankfully, it's right here, but we do have some grunts with feeler rod guns that are 100% dead. Okay, that was kind of like funny in its own right. Oh, that's not good. All right, let's dip. Let's get out of that. Potential mess. Alright, so we're gonna have more to deal with, unfortunately. Quite a bit more. The grenade effect didn't even go off. Although I'm in serious trouble now. Okay, we got jackals down there. Got a jackal right here. He's done. Throw a frag.
So far, so good. He's trying to run away. You ain't running. You ain't running, fool. Oh. oh, that's not good. That's no fun. Oh, yeah, this could be bad. Thankfully, they seem to not be able to shoot around the corner at me, which is good. Okay. I'm kind of surprised that I'm able to do as well as I am. Because I got a little, a little more confidence in myself. We're going to let these, uh... We're going to let the Flood and Covenant fight each other. Just to see what numbers they can thin out. And then, uh, we'll move in and clean up, essentially, afterwards. Oh, wow, did they get them all? Oh. Okay. That worked. <laughs> that worked uh, very well, to say the very least. Since they weren't able to see me, I could just take a solid advantage. Oh no. A freaking gold elite and a scary boy elite. Oh mm, boy. Okay. Let's uh, <laughs> figure this out, eh? I don't think I got rid of the elite. I'm gonna assume it didn't. Yeah, it sure doesn't. Okay. Oh my god! That jackal is an absolute champ. He shot <laughs> that that if that jackal didn't do that, I think we honestly would have been in so much trouble. I'm gonna try to loop around here, because I don't wanna go right out in the middle and just have a bad day. Let's see. Alright. I wish I had grenades. Oh, this elite just took... A good number of shotguns, or at least blasts right to the face, so I'd say it's pretty uh pretty solid all around. Oh, and there's the flood. Nice. You guys just have impeccable timing. My god. That's scary every time. Every time, dude. Okay. Let's grab some grenades. Try to see what other weapons we can swap out, and let's keep pushing on. Huh. I mean, I'm glad to know that. We haven't really uh, encountered too much of an issue. But that doesn't mean things can just go that way forever. Doesn't help that these jackals are kind of being a big meanie. Yeah? Okay. Just gotta be careful moving up, because there's still a ton to deal with. Like these elites. These elites do not help. That much I can assure you. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's, that's happening. Yeah, I'm just gonna dip. I just wish that was had ammo in it. Feels bad.
Okay. More flood. That's over there. I mean, I can just pick them off from here and we'd be all right. Oh, here they come. Jumping right on over like they own the place. What doesn't help is we have not much health to work with. So we'll see uh, if hopefully there's a medkit nearby. I don't think there is. Oh yeah, I don't think there is one bit. Oh, they really expect me to run through that whole area and just be okay. Uh oh. No, 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 no. I'm going here. It was all a hoax. Okay. I'm just trying to use stealth to my advantage, or at the very least, just hide behind cover. Where they don't see me. Oh god, what? Okay, well, now, they're caught in the crossfire. I used to think they were caught in the crossfire. Ooh, there we go. I'm pretty sure there's a flood in there with like a shotgun. Not a shotgun, my bad. A rocket launcher. Did they clear them out? No? I don't think they did. Sit down, fool. Alright. I don't know if they cleared him out or not. I'm going to assume they did because, generally speaking, there's normally uh, one here, so. Oh, he was sitting around the corner. What? You know what? We got him. I don't really care. It worked out in the end. Can't say... Can't say that's a bad thing. Oh yeah, here we go. The games have begun. No, put the shotgun down. We don't like shotguns getting shot right in our face. I and mean, granted, I'm doing that, but I'm the master chief, man. You gotta leave me alone. There is a lot of infection forms, my god. Come on. Seems like there's still more around this corner. Ooh, that could have been a terrible idea. No, screw it. We're just gonna move on. I putting myself at death store a little too many times for my own liking and We've already died a fair amount so far in this playthrough. Oh, it's a good thing I kept that rocket launcher. One banshee down, another to go. And I missed. Well, that's a shame. I really missed. Well, yeah, more like I did miss. <laughs> Did that really miss? Oh, I mean, we have extra shots to work with, so I'm not like that angry, but it'd be nice to not miss. He just, he actually just trolled me with that. All right, come on. I mean, thankfully the shotgun still does pretty considerable amount of damage to a Banshee. Yeah, I know what that one's thinking. It's a shotgun being able to take out a Banshee, but, uh, I don't know. I think it's pretty alright. 
I'm just waiting for him to come after me. What is he doing? There we go. Perfect. 